if you would bear with me uh, for a minute, I think we need to have a perspective about things. Um, I think everybody needs to get a grip. <laughs> you know, media, uh, heat players, organization, you know, all of our fans. You got to get a grip <laughs> on, on greatness and on teams. And, and I've been here, you know, for 45 years in the NBA, and I've witnessed uh, dynasties. I've wit witnessed great teams. You know, the, 80, the 80s Lakers, <laughs> five championships in 12 years. So what does that mean? Seven times they didn't win. They didn't run. They didn't win. You got to deal with it. You got to come back. Celtics were supposed to be a great team in the 80s. 12 years together, three wins, nine losses. Chicago Bulls from 86 to, I think, 87 to 98, uh, 11 times. In 11 years, they won six titles. That's five times that you know Michael Scotty and Horace Grant lost. The Lakers from, I think, 96 with Shaq and Kobe to today, like, you know, 14 or 15 years, they won five. That means they lost 12 times. The Spurs in 17 years, you know, won five titles. So you add it up. What's the math there? You know, they lost 12 times. <laughs> this stuff is hard. And you got to stay together if you got the guts, and you don't find the first door and run out of it <laughs> if you have an opportunity. Uh, this is four years now into uh, this era, this team, four finals. It's only been done three other times before. And two championships from day one to the end, it was like a Broadway show. You know, it sort of run out of steam. And we need to retool. We don't need to rebuild. We need to retool. And that's what we're going to do. I've, uh, I've been a leader and a decision maker. And that's my level of expertise. And I'll do everything I can to retool the team. But everybody, just get a grip. This has been a great run. <laughs> And it ended up, you know, like most losses ended up. You know, I know what it is to win. We've watched it. The confetti drops. Everybody hugs each other, kisses each other. You know, Mandarin embraces, I love you, I love you. Hey, bro, this is how it's going to be. They punch each other. They say, I told you it was going to be like this. This is how it's going to be. <laughs> and, you know, we're, we're best friends, you know, off the court, even better friends off the court than we're players on the court. And it's true. That's what creates a forever bond. But what, what really cements it, cements a forever bond, is going through what we went through this year and staying the course. Uh, so I, I've been through that experience. <laughs> and I know other teams have been through it. And so, you know, 1982, when we beat Philadelphia, they came back the next year and got us. <laughs> and they added Moses Malone to the team. When I choked away, I choked, personally choked away a game in 84, and Magic Johnson was called Tragic Magic, and we were called the LA Fakers and Sissies. That inspired us. We didn't find the first door and run. <laughs> we went home. We didn't like each other that year either. Nobody liked me, and people went off, and they did other things. But we came back in 85, and we got them. We got them good. In 1988, when we got Detroit, you know, and Kareem hit that phantom skyhook foul, he had to make the two free throws. He didn't choke. He did not choke on the free throws. He had to make them. He made them. And that led us to a seventh game and a win. But the next year, Detroit came back and swept us. What happened last year with San Antonio? They run. They faced it. <laughs> They faced it and they came back and we saw the result. We will find out what we're made of here. It's not about options, it's not about free agency. 
it's not about anything. It's about what we have built over four years here, and we have a chance to do something significant. But losing is just as much a part of it as winning is. And when you're a team, you deal with it. No, there was no hugging, and there was no high-fiving. And, you know, there's just looking around the room now and finding out who's going to stand up. And this is time that you go home and take care of yourself and look at yourself. And what are you going to do to come back and make the team better? <laughs> because we have a tremendous opportunity here for long-term success. But don't think we're not going to get beat again. So just get a grip, everybody. That's my message. It's my message to the players also. Have you heard that? Is that huh? the They're hearing it right now. I'm sure they'll hear it. You'll make sure of it. No, not at all. No, just the overall, <clears throat> the overall, uh, uh, you know, fallout. Uh, and I think it's social, uh, media driven. It's, uh, you know, you guys get the blame for everything, you, but you don't deserve it. <laughs> you just write what you write. And how we react to it is how we react to it, and we don't use it, but so it's there every single day. I mean, back in 1984, you know, you know, there was a story, it was filed, and we read it the next day, it was in the trash, and we could go on with our life, <laughs> you know? It was pretty simple. You know, it didn't follow us all summer long. And so, but we live in, a, in an era now where it's like flash dance, okay? So you gotta deal with the everyday scrutiny and, and, and the everyday criticism and the everyday praise and, and all of that stuff and the questions, and you gotta deal with it, and so deal with it. You deal with it by not dealing with it. You, know, you deal with it by doing what you have to do to make yourself better, by taking accountability for yourself and your own actions, and not laying it off on something else or somebody else. You know? No. It's not anything. I had, I had 15 exit meetings the other day, uh, last two days, and you know, you learn a lot in exit meetings about players after you win. You know, I had kisses all over my face when we won. <laughs> Yesterday was just a good handshake. <laughs> really, you know, I mean, come on, you got to deal with winning and losing in this, in this game. And so, and that's what we're dealing with, Ira, to answer your question. I appreciate the... Uh, <laughs> You know, uh, it's, uh, no, it, it isn't just happened to us before. It's happened to all of the great dynasties, uh, you know, in this league have had their moments. 